my name is Morgan. I'm a physiotherapist at Hunters Moor Neuro Rehab Centre. I've been working at Hunters Moor for just over a year now. I started as a band five physiotherapist and then since then I've been able to progress and now I'm a band six. I'm Chris. I have been working here at Hunters Moor since 2013 and that makes it eight years now and I am one of the senior nurses. What made me stay here is because the management has been supportive. They listen to us, whatever it is that we need for our career or for the unit they provide it. Part of my job is helping people to recover functionally with use of exercise and therapy equipment to progress in their independence. So I'm Josie, I'm the principal psychologist here at Hunters Moor but also within the active care group. Professionally I have a great team of people who I work with and I've got lots of aspirations for what to achieve and what we need to be doing, being innovative bringing on board lots of technology, moving with the times, which you can't always find in other places, and making sure that the staff are happy and are being given the opportunity to do what they love doing in the best light possible. My name is Dr. Kire and uh, I am a consultant physician in neurological rehabilitation. And I've been a, the medical director here for the last 11 years and was part of setting up this service. At the end of the day, what we're trying to achieve is to reduce patients' disability, really giving them opportunity to optimize their functional abilities, to re enable them to reintegrate back into community life again. My name is Wahid Olaomir, due to, I had a tumor in my head. Well, I've been here about six, seven weeks now. Oh, I've made great progress due to the physio team here. But the stuff that I've done with uh, these guys, I probably wouldn't have done it normally. You know, calisthenics and this and that. And it's made a lot of difference, you know, and that's what I'm going to stick to now when I get out of here. I, I won't say the standing here, that's why I'm saying it. <laughs> All right, my name's Peter McAllister. I've been here for roughly two and a half years now. I'm starting off on the bank as a rehab assistant and then I quickly moved on up to being a senior rehab assistant on an acting basis. There does seem to be a lot of um, good career progression opportunities for people that come into the company. I find they are being really supportive with it. They're doing regular opportunities every year where you can move on up and do associate programmes with them. Whether that's in therapy or nursing, or there's quite a lot of different roles you can do. Neuro is something that I really enjoy just because working with clients for such a long period you get to build that rapport and you get more of a relationship and you see them more frequently so it's really nice to see their progress. Here at Hunters Moor it's always a collaborative approach. We work with the therapy team, it's an MDT, in order for us to look at how to support the patients develop their full potentials. The company Active Care Group are really investing in, in its staff and they care about the residents and they want the residents' journey to be a good one and the acknowledgement that everybody works really hard and the reason we work hard is for our residents, to give them the outcomes they want. Uh, Bruce Edwards and I've been here probably two months now, I think. I'm waiting for a head rafter, um, part of my score to be replaced. You're very much part of the team, to be honest, because as an individual you're given time and you're given space, but you can also concentrate on what you're doing and uh, the staff are really patient with that, it's good. Everybody's cool, everybody's nice here and I suppose you need to have that sort of persona about you to be working in a place like this. Staff members who've come to work for Active Care Group have had the opportunity to work on themselves, to be able to become trained in other disciplines. So we've had people who've come in as uh, support workers and have worked their way up to being a qualified occupational therapist. There are many opportunities for people to engage in preceptorships, in new styles of working, new courses. These things are all invested in for our staff so that we can better ourselves and keep providing innovative therapies to the people who come through our doors. We're looking for dedicated clinicians and individuals who will come into this specialty with passion and dedication to be able to make a difference in the life of people. I'm not saying that it's an easy shift all the time, but it's a good community from my own perspective uh, and, and experience people to listen to you, whether it's part of maintenance team, housekeeping, management, my own colleagues, therapy team, it's one unit. There's no, for me, there's no boundary. Um, we work together. You have to be very patient and understanding and compassionate and just have the time to 
sit there and get to know the clients and what they like, what their goals are. It is really enjoyable if you like seeing how people are doing over a long period of time, putting in the hard work, you don't see instant results, but it shows that you've achieved something with that person and working towards that goal orientated um, goals is just really nice. With regards to those people who are wanting to work within healthcare and thinking about coming to work for Active Care Group, what I can say is it's definitely something to come and do. There's always that element of trying to help people to fulfill their um, careers and their dreams about that. So this is what Active Care Group is able to do for you.